Good morning, Loft Meadows. Today is Friday, October 27th. As you can see, today is a fantastic TGIF. I'm ready for the next PBS event, the Masquerade Ball. Speaking of PBS, let's find out who this week's red coats, <coughs> I mean red shirt, winners are. Ben, did you know that the first Halloween was celebrated over 2,000 years ago in Europe? Arg! I had no idea. They had a festival called Samhain on the last day of summer, October 31st. I've been all over the United States, but I've never been to Europe. Speaking of traveling, let's find out where Jose is. Arr. Hey, Ben. I just read that owls were believed to be witches in medieval Europe. And here I thought they were just our school mascot. Did you know that some owls are even native to Florida? Speaking of owls, our Laugh Minoke's owl took a trip too. Ben, did you change again? Of course I did. Did you know that people in Europe used to believe that witches can turn themselves into cats? No way that's real. That's definitely superstition. Well, I only believe it in facts. You want fact? Check out this 60 second science. Hey Ben! What are you wearing now? No matter what costume you choose or how you celebrate the holiday, always stay safe. Thanks for watching our show, Owls. Have a great day. Here at the Oaks. Good morning, Owls. Today is Friday, December 15th, and we're live at the Gingerbread Shop. Did you know that Santa travels all around the world in just one night? The fifth graders did some traveling, too. Let's find out where they went. There are so many amazing things at the gingerbread shop. I don't know whether to get this or this. I love the gingerbread shop, but that's not the only cool thing happening at school. You're right, these PBS winners are pretty amazing too. We elves have been working in Santa's workshop for hundreds of years. Santa taught us to always have a positive attitude and never give up. That's why we never miss our Christmas quota for making toys. And here at Laugh and Oaks, we always have a positive attitude too. Ben, what are you doing? Well, I'm conducting an experiment to see which flavor of hot chocolate I like the best. That's not an experiment. I know, you need variables and controls and stuff. I was just looking for an excuse to drink hot chocolate with Rob. Well then make sure you and Rob watch this next segment, 60 Second Science. That's our show, Owls. Get in the holiday spirit and come visit the gingerbread shop. It's open all next week. Happy Holidays! Good morning, Owls. Today is Friday, February 9th. Can you feel it? Feel what? Love. Love is in the air. Oh yeah, it's almost Valentine's Day. Speaking of love, let's show some love to our new red shirt winners. Vegas. I just learned that Valentine's Day originated in Italy. And now the love has spread all over the world. Well, Desiree is on the other side of the country, and I just love learning about new places. Me too. Vegas, I have got my teacher this awesome Valentine's Day gift. You better have gotten her something nice. Of course. Did you know that every year teachers get the most Valentine's Day treats? Speaking of treats, let's find out what you all did at McTeacher's Night. Ben, if you keep eating that much candy, you're really gonna get sick. I know, but it's so good. One thing this school can't have too much of is science. That's our show, Owls. Remember, Valentine's Day is about kindness and love. Make sure to share the love with family and friends. Oh, I'll share the love all right, just not my candy. Good morning, Owls. Today is Friday, November 17th. You know what that means. Next week is Thanksgiving. We get one whole week off of school. Yes! Please stand for the pledge. The first Thanksgiving was held between the Pilgrims and the Native Americans. It was a huge celebration. Did you know that it lasted for three whole days? It was an enormous feast. Wow, that's interesting. You know what else is interesting? 60 Second Science. The Pilgrims went on a long journey across the Atlantic to get to America on a ship called the Mayflower. Scenario went on a journey too, all the way to Arizona. The voyage on the Mayflower took 66 days. Whenever I go on a long journey, 
I bring a great book. Speaking of books, let's find out who the best readers are. Thanks for watching our show, Els. All this food talk is making me hungry. I'm gonna eat some turkey while you watch the video montage. Good morning, Alice. Today is Friday, February 16th. I'd call it a freezing Friday. It can get really cold in February. P -p -p Please stand for the p -p 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 pledge. Vegas, I know something that'll warm you up. What's the something? Learning about fractions. Mm -hmm. Ben, you know what I like to do on a cold day? What? Sit back and read books. Yeah, me too. Let's find out who this week's AR winners are. Hey Vegas, Captain DeGraff ordered some new books for us in the library. If you need any help finding new books, this segment is for you. Ben, this month is our annual Have a Heart, Help a Pet service project. Oh cool, I rescued my cat Navi and I'd love to help more animals. Then watch this story to find out how. Vegas, I know a place much colder than here right now. I find that hard to believe, but where? Pyeongchang, South Korea, where the Olympic Games are being held. That's right, Ben. And here's Desiree with the report. That's our show, Else. Now to really get our blood pumping with the, the video, video montage. montage.